Don't tell me you didn't know that. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. Now on. I agree with you. Enough trouble as it is. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. You listen to the wrong people. That's not what my husband thinks. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. You know who to believe these days. Show me your wares. Certainly, oh, brother of the ring. I'd have gone about it differently. Been there, done that. It's a bad business. I couldn't get away with that. That was obvious all along. No one really wants to hear that. That was obvious all along. I'm staying out of it. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. You just have to listen. That's been known a long time. It was his decision, wasn't it? Do you really believe that? Same old thing, all over again. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. Certainly. I've got no time for things like that. I never knew that. It had to happen sooner or later. <laughs> you hardly know who to believe these days. That's no secret.
bless me. I bless you in the name of Inos. May the Lord's fire burn in your heart and give you the strength to act according to his justice. Show me your wares. May Inos watch over you always. Nothing to be had there. Nothing there. Nothing to be had there. Nothing to plunder. Nothing there. Hey, you. Hey, you. Ever been to the monastery? Maybe. Why? Are they still taking on people? I wouldn't know where else to turn. Where do you come from? I used to be captain of a big whaler, my boy. The sea is my home. My ship, the good old Magdalena, was sunk by pirates a few months ago, and now I'm stranded here. All I ever wanted was to go back to sea. But since I've come here, not one schooner is called at this accursed port. The only ship which is anchored in Corinus is that blasted war galley of the king. And they don't take on anyone. So what else can I do? There's no work for me in town. I've tried everything. You'd better get off the road. Eh, hey, don't worry. I've already noticed that the wilderness out here has become damn dangerous in the last couple of days. I can hardly believe it. Are you really a paladin now? Obviously. If someone like you is with the paladins, then Beliar's thugs had better watch out. If you did in the sleeper, that handful of orcs shouldn't be a problem. This is not only about the orcs. I know, but it's still good to have you on our side. Oh well. What are you doing here in the monastery? Let me guess. You want to be instructed in the art of magic. Perhaps. I knew it. Best to talk to Marduk. He's responsible for you paladins. You'll find him in front of the chapel. I need to get into the monastery. It's urgent. Yes, sure. Here's the key. How did you get to the monastery so fast? What kind of a question is that? I crept through the pass and made my way straight to the monastery. Admittedly, it was never easy avoiding all the monsters making themselves at home on this side of the valley, but ultimately I encountered fewer problems than I expected. Do you know where the others are? Gorn seems to have coped with his stay in Garan's dungeon very well. In any case, he wanted to go to Lee and see what was happening on the farm. After the grub they serve in the dungeon, he's probably stuffing his face right now and putting the mercenaries' provisions to a real test. Diego mumbled something about a reckoning. No idea what he meant by that. But I suspect he's in the city. You know him. Always there when there's something to be had. Do you know anything about the hooded figures? No, but I have a bad feeling about those guys. Be careful if you run into them. I see that you have decided to fight on our side. I am glad. We can use every man. You should go speak directly to Marduk. He is responsible for you paladins. 
Have you got anything else for me? Yes. As a member of the library, you are given the key to the library. There you will find brothers Karis and Hygras. If you like, you can speak with them there. May Inos protect you. How are the sheep? How do you think they are? They stand around and munch grass. I'd rather know what's happening outside. The magicians seem to be very nervous. Strangers in black robes roam the countryside. What do you mean? What sort of stranger? Nobody knows where they've come from. They wear long black robes and they cover their faces. They seem to be some kind of magician. At least they're capable of magic. That sounds very disturbing, but I'm sure that the High Council will solve this problem. There are dragons in the Valley of Mines. They are besieging the royal troops together with the army of orcs. Dragons? I always thought they only existed in horror stories. They're there, believe me. But the King's Paladins will deal with them, won't they? We'll see. Welcome, my son. Since when are you one of the paladins? Only for a short time. Then I bid you welcome. In this battle we need every man who has the courage to oppose evil. The fate of us all lies in the hands of men like you. May Innos ever give you the courage you need. What's your job here? I prepare the paladins for their fight against evil. What is evil? Evil is everywhere. It is the power of Biliar, the eternal adversary of Innos. It is the all-encompassing blackness which seems to blot out the light of Innos forever. Biliar is the lord of darkness, of hate, and of destruction. Only those among us in whose hearts burns the holy fire of Innos will bear the radiant light of Innos into the world and banish the darkness. But there are only magicians and novices living in the monastery. That is correct, in contrast to our community which honors the word of Innos. The paladins honor the great deeds of our lord above all else. We are the representatives of Innos, but the paladins are his warriors, who go into battle in his name and increase his glory. Is there anything you can teach me? I am an expert in the magic of ice and the magic of thunder. I can teach you their power. However, I only instruct magicians. What can you teach me? Naturally, I cannot teach you your combat skills. I can, however, bring the essence of Innos and his gifts closer to you. Besides, it is my task to prepare you for the consecration of the sword. And the magic? Here we teach only our magic. You must learn the magic of the paladins in the city. What's the consecration of the sword? The consecration of the sword is one of the paladins' most sacred rituals. During this ceremony, the holy power of Innos flows through the blade of the paladin's sword and gives the sword undreamed of powers. A sword so consecrated is a paladin's most valuable possession and will accompany him his whole life long. What do you mean by that? When Innos had to leave our world, he left humankind a part of his divine power. Only a few of us humans are allowed to use his power and to oversee justice in his name. And what do you want to bring closer to me? I can set you on the right path to recognize the essence of Innos and follow him. Maybe later. You are heartily welcome here anytime. I want to consecrate my sword. If you are determined to take this step, you will first need a blade of tempered ore. With this, you should then retreat to the chapel 
and pray. During the prayer, and after a reasonable donation to our Lord Enos, you should ask Enos for his grace and guidance in the battle against evil. If Enos is well disposed towards you, your sword will be consecrated to our Lord from that moment on. Where can I get a magic blade? Try in the city with Herod the smith. He provides the paladins with specially tempered blades while they are on the island. What kind of a donation? Now in view of the grace that is granted to you, a sum of 5,000 gold pieces is more than suitable. Of course you are allowed to give more. Any news? The enemy has apparently already entered the city. What do you mean? One of the paladins, Lothar, was murdered in the street. In broad daylight, it has gone too far, but I fear that is only the beginning. Bennett is innocent. The witness lied. How do you know that? I have found proof. Sometimes I think that treason and greed are our greatest enemies. What's going to happen now? A murder, moreover, of a paladin is without doubt one of the worst crimes there is. The murderer will undoubtedly be sentenced to death. Some citizens of Corinus have mysteriously disappeared. Take your tribute to Gorax at the monastery at once. He will handle it further. The same is true for the investigation of the unusual earthquakes in the northeastern regions of Corinus. So far, I have not received notice that our intervention would be required. Therefore, we are not going to take any steps in this matter. Yes, but... No buts. We shall proceed as we see fit. And I hope even you are going to respect that. I think I'm possessed. Can you heal me? Not without a token of your respect for this monastery, my son. Three hundred gold coins. Great. Here's the money. Bring me the money and you will be helped. I've come from the Old Valley of Mines. What do you have to report? The enemy has formed up there with an army of orcs and dragons. We have already learned that from Milton. But what about the king's shipment of ore? The mine they are digging for Garand in the valley cannot satisfy the demands of the king. The days are becoming grayer, and the light of the sun is ever weaker. I was attacked by men in black robes. I know. Those are the Seekers, henchmen from the nether realms of Beliar. Beware of them. They will try to take possession of you. Once possessed, you will no longer be yourself. Only here in the monastery could you find help then, so be careful. Here, this rune will bring you directly back to the monastery if you need our help. Remember, we must offer resistance or we shall all be doomed. I have come to take the Eye of Inos. I see that you have received an authorization from Lord Hagen himself to bear the Eye of Enos. I am afraid that I have to disappoint you. We have fallen victim to a treacherous plot of the enemy. The Eye of Enos has been violently taken from these sacred walls. Who did this? Evil is cunning and usually works in secret. Only rarely do you see it emerge to pursue its evil machinations in broad daylight. But these days, it's a different matter. The enemy now shows himself openly in the street, in every home and every public square. This can only mean that he no longer fears any adversary and is not going to shrink back from anything. One of our most faithful followers, a candidate for the high robe of the Magicians of Fire, has changed his allegiance unexpectedly, and in an alarmingly evil manner, Pedro. 
The enemy has taken possession of him, thus inflicting a terrible defeat upon us. Pedro has forced his way into our most sacred halls and stolen the eye. I fear that he simply spent too much time by himself, outside of the gates, and thus beyond the protective walls of the monastery, exposed to all lurking dangers. Where did the thief flee to? Pedro knocked down some of the other novices who tried to stop him and disappeared into the morning mist. Many novices have gone after him to bring the eye back to its place unharmed. If you want to catch up with him, you need to hurry before Pedro disappears out of your reach. What about a little blessing? I could surely use it. May Eno stand between you and harm on all the unholy paths you will have to walk. Is there anything else you want to tell me? Dismissed. You know what you have to do. One more thing. Some of the roadside shrines dedicated to Enos have been desecrated by the enemy. They have lost their magical consecration. I see. And now? It is up to you to purify these shrines so that the situation does not escalate. Take this holy water and trickle it on the base of the shrine. With the holy words of purification, the shrine will regain its old power. Now, go and perform your tasks. Any news? No. Nothing which you do not already know, brother. Hey, you! Can I borrow some more money from you? No more now. I just had a big outlay and I need... Come back! What with? Wait a minute. There you are again. I want to sell the weapons I forged. Good. Give it here. Fine. And here's your pay. Wait a minute. What are you planting here? We're trying to grow healing plants that Master Neoras can use to brew potions. So, how's it going? Oh, thank you for your concern, Sir Paladin. I enjoy the work and I am certain to be selected as a magician soon. Wait a minute. Can I be of assistance to you?
What's your task here? My tasks are many and varied. Not only am I the steward, but I am also the treasurer. Moreover, I supervise the wine cellar, and I'm in control of the monastery's food supplies. So, if there's anything you need, you can always come to me and get it. For a modest contribution, that is. I need a few things. I'll never get this open without the right key. I'll never get this open without the right key. Hey, you! What? What's wrong? Why are you bothering me? Can't you see I'm in the middle of an extremely complicated experiment? I didn't mean to disturb you. You already have. Oh, well, what do you want? Could you brew me a potion? Do you doubt my abilities? I can brew any potion. Fine. Not so fast. Naturally, you must bring me the ingredients and pay a small fee for expenses, as well as for the materials. How much do you ask? For the brewing itself, I charge 10 gold pieces. Can I learn from you? I shall instruct you in the secrets of alchemy. Hey! Traveling so far from home? Out here you have to be careful, especially when you're all by yourself. What are you doing out here? Well, the tavern is too expensive for me. That's why I settled here. The previous inhabitants don't seem to need it anymore. Who used to live in this camp? No idea. Probably some hunters. I suppose it got too dangerous for them out here. Isn't it too dangerous out here? Well, not if you can defend yourself. My crossbow has already proven to be of service many times. It's not all that big. But deadly, if you know how to handle it. I used to have a bigger one. Unfortunately, I lost it. I ventured too far north into the mountains. There's a big stone circle there, with a sacrificial altar. While I was hunting scavengers up there, these vile undead beings came out of the woods and attacked me. All I could do was run for my life. While I was running, the crossbow slipped from my hand. I bet it's still lying up there by that strange stone circle in the north. Can you teach me something? Before I teach you anything, you'll have to improve your dexterity.
shall get you. Nothing to plunder. Nothing to plunder. Inos, grant me your aid and purify this shrine. What's going on here? What do you mean? You're the second fellow to rush past here like he's been stung by blood flies. Who was the other guy? He looked like one of those brainy novices from the monastery back there. You can say what you like, but somehow those guys aren't quite right in the head. Where did the other one go? He ran up that way like lightning. I need to get going. Hey, no problem.
Nothing to plunder.
Nothing to be had there. Inos, grant me your aid and purify this shrine. Nothing there.
Hey! Have you seen a novice pass by here? A lot of peculiar figures pass by here today, including those two jokers up by the stone arch. A while ago, a novice from the Magicians of Fire was with them as well. Are you waiting for someone? Not anymore. You're here now, aren't you? Why me? You look strong. I could use a fella like you. What are you up to? I want to hunt the snappers up there. But I think there may be too many for me alone. Okay, I'll help you. You go first. <laughs> sure thing. But don't get too close to the black trowel back there. He'll rip you to pieces otherwise. Got it? And we'll betide you if you chicken out. Another one of those things. All right. So much for... All right. So much for you, filthy beast. Can you teach me how to hunt? Hmm. All right. You haven't been much help to me so far, but let's not be too harsh. Teach me how to hunt. What exactly do you want to know? Minecrawler plates stick very tightly to the beast's bodies, but you can get them off with a sharp, sturdy object. Teach me how to hunt. What exactly do you want to know? You can either just rip off the blood fly's wings or detach them with a sharp knife. Teach me how to hunt. What exactly do you want to know? It's really no problem removing a blood fly's stinger. Just have to find the base and firmly shove in your knife. Teach me how to hunt. You already know everything I could teach you. Nothing to plunder. Nothing to be had there. Nothing there. Inos, grant me your aid and purify this shrine.
nothing there. I'm looking for a novice. That's very interesting. We're looking for someone, too. Uh, who would that be? You. I'm gonna rip you to pieces. Bandit. What a silly bastard. What a silly bastard.
Minos, so that it can never regain its power. We shall now demonstrate the futility of your attempt to challenge the Master.
Hey, you. Nobody ever asks me. Any news? You're responsible for the best news yourself. They've let Bennett go again. He's back at the farm. Go to him. I think he'd like to thank you himself. Hey, you! Teach me something. There's nothing else I can teach you. You become too good. Hey, you! Teach. There's nothing else. Good. Your strength has increased. Just like you said. But he knew that all along. I'm not touching that. You hardly know who to believe these days. And Beliar Nobody spoke wants to, to know. another creature. But Adonos brought forth the tide, and the creature was washed from the face of the earth. I don't believe that. Wait a minute. I've got some special snapper claws for you. My customer will be happy to hear that. Here's the ring I promised you. But that's terrible. Show me your wares. Now that's typical, isn't it? That's not what my husband thinks. He had better shut up. Someone's got to do the work. That's an open secret. You don't say. I won't tell her a thing from now on. He simply talks too much. The beast, and it entered into That's terrible. These are bad times. I won't tell her a thing from now on. You don't say. That's not what I heard. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. These are bad times. I can't take care of everything for everybody. That's an open secret. But Adonis feared for the day I'm in no which better the off myself. would return to the land. Inos deals out fair punishment. Wait and see. Don't tell me you didn't know that. We can only wait and see. And Enos! I've got a problem with the eye of Enos. I could use your help. And will your problem require me to leave town? I don't know. Possibly. I've been waiting to be relieved for days. The other water mages should have been back in Corinus some time ago. If you see to it that at least one of them comes to take over my duties in town, I shall be free to help you solve your problem. I've got this feeling of trepidation. You don't look well either. You were subjected to the black look of the Seekers for too long. All I can heal is your body. But only the monastery can purify your soul. Speak to Pyrakar. He will help you.
doesn't surprise me. I don't know why he gets so worked up. Hey. Well, don't get all worked up. Beat it. Inos, grant me your aid and purify this shrine. change. I have found the Eye of Inos. It's broken. But that cannot be. What happened? Some really nasty customers had it. Anyway, I came too late. They were performing a strange incantation on a crescent-shaped ritual site up in those woods. Inos be with us. They have desecrated our circle of the sun. Even in my worst nightmares, I could never have imagined they would possess this kind of power. What can we do now? The enemy has become very strong. Still, this ancient artifact meant a powerful threat to him. We must heal the eye and restore its old power, but time works against us. I cannot begin to imagine what is now going to become of us all. Without the protection of the Eye, we are helplessly at the mercy of the enemy. Go to Vatras, the water mage in town. In this terrible situation, only he will know what is to be done. Take the Eye to him and hurry! What is the Circle of the Sun? Every year, all the magicians and novices of the monastery travel to this place at the time of the solstice to mark the beginning of a new cycle. The place is filled with the immeasurable power of the sun. Never have I entertained the slightest notion that its power could be reversed. And yet, that is what happened. I think I'm possessed. Can you heal me? Not without a token of your respect for this monastery, my son. Three hundred gold coins. Great. Here's the money. Here. Drink this. May the mercy of Enos be your salvation. Can't rely on that. You better watch out who you tell that to. He really should have known that. Hey, you! The honorable warriors of Innos rarely stray into these rooms. What can I do for you? Nobody ever asks me. I have brought back the Eye of Innos. I am relieved you were able to snatch the Eye away from the enemy, but the danger has not been averted. Evil is making further plans and is proceeding with unusual aggression. I've already figured that out for myself. Do not mock me. The situation is serious, very serious, and we don't know whom we can trust. The enemy has already succeeded in leading the novice Pedro into temptation, and he may have success with many others. What exactly is your job? It is my responsibility to train mages in the art of spherical manifestation. 
What does that mean? Well, I teach them how to summon creatures or beings from other states or spheres. This is usually called summoning, although this expression alone is insufficient for the art of calling a servant. Furthermore, I own some interesting spell scrolls which Gorax does not have. How are your studies coming along? The enemy has many faces. Which of them presents the greatest danger for the monastery is awfully difficult to determine. How are you? The enemy. Show me your wares. You don't have to ask me that. I could tell you. Hey! I am Master Highglass, guardian of the fire and keeper of the knowledge. What are you studying, Master? My research focuses on fire, the power of Enos. It is his gift and at the same time a mighty weapon, and I create runes which contain his power. Any news? Hmm, yes. Well, you've probably noticed those black robe figures. I've met them. This brings us to the core of the matter. At the moment, we're observing a very rare constellation of stars. To be more exact, the sign of the ox currently stands in direct correlation with the sign of the warrior. I suppose you know what that means. Hmm, well, to be honest. Yes, I see. Well, I cannot explain the entire background to you now, but it definitely signifies a great change, and I do not like change. Therefore, I want you to get me a book from town. It's called The Divine Power of the Stars. You may have to rummage around for it a bit, but I'm sure you'll find it. What's in it for me? What do you mean? I'd like to know what you'll give me if I bring you the book. Nothing. What were you expecting to get? If you have time to run an errand in town for me, it's even your duty to help me. You have to watch out for me, tell me. Hey! There you are again. Can you repair jewelry? I'm a weaponsmith, not a goldsmith. You probably won't find anyone here in the city who can help you. People don't have much money in their pockets anymore. And nobody's gotten rich here in quite a while. Most of them are just glad if they have enough to eat. Someone's gotta do the work. Where can I find a goldsmith? There's supposed to be a good smith with the mercenaries on Onar's farm. Maybe you should look there. You mustn't believe everything you hear. Let's wait and see what happens. You should have known better. Nobody ever asked for my opinion. That's an open secret. You don't have heard a thing or two. He had better. Why I heard about this Look, I've got a statue of Innos for you. Oh, thank you. Very, very much. May Innos let his light shine on you. Yeah, never mind. Hey! 
Show me your wares. There isn't much choice, I'm afraid. Will you look at that? What do you want? Have you joined the city beggars? Looks like it. I'll tell you something. what I heard. No matter what you're wearing, I can see right through you. To me, you're just a greasy little idler, nothing more. What's your problem? I know people of your sort. All talk, no guts. I detest somebody who dresses up all important and brags about his heroic deeds. That's Just yesterday, I slugged one of the boys here in the mouth Nobody because he claimed he could bring down a black troll with one hand tied he behind his back. So what? What's that supposed to mean? Nobody ever so what? Have you ever seen a black troll, Big Mouth? Do you have any idea how big days. those monsters are, man? If you really just get one that. step too close to them, They'll tear you to That's pieces. I heard. I'm staying out of it. Black troll, no problem. You're him. asking for it, huh? I ought to rip your head off. He doesn't see that. But I've got I a better help. idea. If you're such a great fighter, then prove it. Out. What's in it for me? Stupid I'm question. You new. Your honor and your jaw in one piece? He That's not a whole lot, is it? Shall we say, tell me you didn't I'll pay that. you a ton of money if you bring me the hide of a black troll. Like How's that sound? Better. Then what are you he waiting for? That himself. But he knew that all Everything before. else all right? Don't babble so much. Go Nobody and get me that black troll me. hide. I've heard of me it. thinks I'm gonna punch you in the face. What? That's exactly what you need right now. I've been too nice to you so far, like haven't I? Yeah, he really said that. Ah. 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 Go ah. ahead, hit hurt. back! Let that him have it! Spot. Nothing to be had there. I agree with you, Drop myself. Man, and here I was I thinking they'd really hang me. Well, it worked all right in the end. You can say that again. You should have seen the face of the soldier when he had to let me out. He was so scared, he almost did it in his pants. Which reminds me, I've got something for you. What do you mean? A present. That's really what present? We have heard of the dragons that are said to be in the valley. They're really there. All right, I believe you. Anyway, I thought you would surely want to participate in the upcoming dragon hunt. And? Here, take this amulet. I think you'll need it more than I do. That's that was obviously my problem. Can you repair jewelry? That depends. You would have to show me the piece. If he doesn't see that, you hardly know who to believe. Can you have a look at this amulet? Sure, let me see. Hmm, that is a beautiful piece of work. The setting is shot. I think I can fix it, though. How long will it take you? If you leave it here with me, it'll be done by the time you come back tomorrow. And I won't even charge you for it. You got me out of the slammer after all. Will it ever change? I agree with you. Here's the amulet. Please repair it for me. All right. I'll have finished the new setting by tomorrow. You can come to me and get it then. Differently. He didn't get that from me. He ever asked for mine. What about forging equipment? What do you need? Of course, we got him to get that from me. 
Nobody will learn anything from me. I hardly know what's for a thing or two. Teach me how to forge magic ore weapons. As long as you are only... And that's like... I wouldn't be so sure. No big deal. That's nothing new. You hardly know who to believe these days. Can I have some more of your stew? I heard you helped Bennett get out of jail. Good job, kid. You just have to listen. You don't have to tell me that. The two of us should have a chat. Listen, you won. Now leave me alone. I won't have anything to do with thieves. Lee is going to hear about this, and you're going to have to pay. Hey, asshole! You don't actually think I'd get involved in a duel with you. Go crawl back under your rock. How's it going? Have I given you permission to address me? The two of us. Listen, you. He really didn't deserve that. Sort things out. Wait a minute. Just gossip. You have to step in and sort things out. I can't believe that. That's really not my problem. Everything all right with you? You saved my ass, man. I'll never forget that. What do you want to do now? I think I'll load up on grub first. And then? Who knows? Maybe I'll go back to the mining colony. Someone should keep an eye on the orcs. Otherwise, they'll all show up on the doorstep without warning. Said ah, it's good that you've come. What's up? I, I found this in the old chapel. Here. It's a magic rune. I think I'll it will teleport you straight back here to the farm. I thought you might be able to use it. I've heard a thing or two. It's a good thing you've come. I have heard that you stole something here. Have gone about you just different. can't pull that kind of thing around here. In such cases, ideas. owner insisted I bring the culprit to account. Here. That here means you that. pay and he pockets the cash. But then at least just the matter is forgotten. How much? 250 gold pieces. I agree with you completely. Yeah, of course I want to pay the end. penalty. Good. I'll see to it that Onar Do gets the money. Really you can consider the matter forgotten. I hardly know what to believe anymore. I've come from the Valley of Mines. The castle That's there the was attacked by dragons. So it's true. Lars said that rumors about need. dragons are circulating through the city. I didn't believe it. What I about the paladins? These They've days. been thoroughly decimated. Good. Maybe that will make Lord Hagen move to the Valley of Mines with his men. Really believe that? The fewer paladins stay here, the better. I've got my own opinion about that. That was obvious all along. You mustn't believe every... Hey, you! Is the amulet ready? Yes. Here. I had to make a new setting for the stone. I worked on it all night, and now it's as good as new. That's the first I've heard of it. Don't say you didn't know that. Hey, you! Can I buy weapons from you? I don't have much. We take almost all the swords and axes into Onar's house. Forever. That's the first I've heard of it. Hey. 
The Eye of Innos has been destroyed. What are you saying? Destroyed? I found it up in the northern forests. Unfortunately, I've only been able to salvage its fragments. That was our only chance to stand up to those dragons, and it's gone. We have failed. What now? This is a painful blow. We have to reorient ourselves. I shall retreat and ponder the matter. In the meantime, you should go to town and talk to Vatras, the water mage. I could imagine that maybe he knows what's to be done. seen it with my own eyes. I don't believe that. What with? There you are again. I want to sell the weapons I forged. Good. Give it here. Fine. And here's your pay. Hey, you! What recipe? I know. Show me your wares. But so great was the wrath of Beliar that he came across the land and chose the beast and. Hey, you! I've got the book for you. So you've changed your mind after all. Very good. So where do you have the book? You may withdraw now. I shall retire and study. Found anything out yet? Well, I cannot be completely sure, but the current constellation of the stars seem to indicate many dangers. What kind of dangers? Well, the structure between the worlds seems to be very weak. It only takes a small portion of the power that would be necessary otherwise to tear a hole in this structure. Demons could use those portals to enter our world without encountering resistance. Oh my goodness! He thinks it's as easy as that. You'll regret this. Stop it now! 
Stop it, right now! Oh, man. My head. Ah, there's to be no fighting here, and don't you forget it! Well, at least you've got some gold on you. I think I'll take your weapon. No fighting here, do you understand? There Nothing to plunder. Just you wait, you son of a bitch. Oh man. Ah! My head. Nothing to be had there. Oh man, my head. Oh! Never pick a fight with me again. You don't even. Hey, you! I am supposed to find the lost parts of the ornament for Nefarious. What? That's unbelievable. You're involved again? Don't worry, I'll bring the things here. I belong to the Ring of Water now. As I see, you bear our secret sign, the Aquamarine Ring. And I see in your eyes that you speak the truth. Very well. I shall accept your entrance into our ranks, but bear in mind that this comes with a great responsibility, and I hope for your sake that you'll do it justice. What sort of strange earthquakes are those? That is one of the puzzles I am trying to solve. The structure of magic is being disturbed somewhere behind these mountains. Quite obviously, someone is trying with all of his might to break a powerful magic. I fear it will not be long before the entire island is plagued by these tremors. Found out anything new? Not really. Come back again later.
Hey, you! About the missing ornaments. Yes? I found them. Well, that's terrific. Now I have them all. Now all we have to do is put them together. We will have to use our combined powers to fit the piece back into a ring. Here, I can give you some gold coins for your trouble. Follow me. Can you sell me some equipment? Tell me what you need. There. And now, step aside. has been put back together. Since you brought us the necessary fragments, you should also set them into the portal. Go to Satyrus and let him give you the reassembled ring. Hopefully the portal will then open. Hey, you! Give me the ring. I shall open the portal. Good. As a new member, you should be granted this honor. However, I'm still waiting for a message from Vatras. Until I receive it, we cannot go. I have a message from Vatras for you. Very interesting. All right, here, take the ring. We shall gather at the portal and wait for you. If Nefarious is right, the portal will open as soon as you insert the ring there. <laughs> 